One thing that is very underrated is the health of your Windows install. Over the months, one year, two years, three years, your Windows is going to start getting bloated, sometimes whether you want it or not. And it's pretty good to reinstall Windows every now and then or start noticing that random shit stopped working like it's supposed to. So I reinstalled Windows without installing any app from any company. No Asus Armor Crate, whatever MSI have, whatever Gigabyte have, Corsair, nothing. First, I went into the BIOS and I disabled the pop-up that prompts you to install Armor Crate when you load into a new Windows install. It still fucking appeared. What the fuck is? But I clicked no and it never appeared again. And then I installed nothing other than Signal RGB to control my RGB and Aqua Suite because I have an Aqua Computers controller. But if you don't, you probably are just using normal fan headers. You install fan control for your fans. Signal RGB for RGB, fan controls for your fans, nothing else. I understand that many of you need those apps for your keyboard, mouse, headsets. So for that, I can't really help you for many of them. But for example, I have a Razer mouse. So I need Razer Synapse. I install Razer Synapse. I set all my stuff, my key binds, everything. And then I close it and I make sure it doesn't start with Windows and it's not running in the background. And all that stuff gets saved in the mouse anyway. I know it does because when I plug the mouse into a computer that never even had Razer installed, all my key binds and DPI settings and everything are there. The RGB is not, but who cares? Another thing is you can use Win Iro Tweaker to disable telemetry, disable automatic Windows updates, disable a bunch of shit, change the right-click menu on Windows 11 to be like Windows 10. I also make stuff appear faster when you hover on it. You can, you know, change things however you like it. I still install hardware for 64 to monitor my sensors. I install MSI Afterburner because I want the RTSS overlay and I install Asus GPU Tweak 3 so I can have a different overclocking profile per game. Unfortunately, Afterburner doesn't allow you to do that. And I install Wallpaper Engine because I want things to look nice. But trust me, for me, just not installing Asus Armory Crate was just a difference. Windows just feels better to use. So imagine you have Asus Armory Crate or whatever MSI or Gigabyte have and then you have NZXT CAM because you have an NZXT AIO and then you have Corsair IQ because you have Corsair RAM or Corsair Keyboard or something and then maybe you have the SteelSeries different device. It's just so much shit.